Planet of the Apes is an American science fiction television series that aired on CBS in 1974. The series stars Roddy McDowell, Ron Harper, James Nocton, Mark Leonard and Booth Coleman. It is based on the 1968 Planet of the Apes film and its sequels, which were inspired by the novel Planet of the Apes by Pierre Boulle. Overview The series begins with the crash of an Earth spaceship that encountered a time warp while approaching Alpha Centauri on August 19, 1980. The spaceship is manned by three astronauts, one of whom has died in the crash. The other two astronauts, Colonel Alan Verdon and Major Peter J. Burke, are unconscious but are rescued by a human who carries them to an old bomb shelter. After the human opens a book containing historical text and pictures of Earth circa 2500, the two astronauts are convinced that they are indeed on a future Earth. The crash is also witnessed by a young chimpanzee who tells his father, a village official who alerts the authorities. Ape counselor Zayas, an analogue of the character from the original movie, notes that another such incident occurred ten years earlier. He orders the head gorilla, security chief Urko, to find the humans and bring them back alive. Zayas wants to find out as much as he can about the humans before they are eventually killed. Zayas doesn't trust Urko to follow his orders and bring back any surviving humans, so he sends along his newly hired chimpanzee assistant, Galen. Both Verdon and Burke go back to their ship to check the ship's chronometer. They are more than 1,000 years in the future from when they left Earth. Verdon insists on retrieving the ship's flight log in the hopes that they will be able to analyze it and be able to return to their own time period, but while they are at the ship, they are captured, and the old man is subsequently killed by a group of apes. Galen finds the human book that the old man had been carrying. He reads parts of the book and begins to doubt the history that he has been told. Apes have always been dominant, and humans have always been inferior and subservient. When Galen finds out that Urko has arranged for the two astronauts to escape and be killed in the attempt, he stops the shooter and helps the humans escape. During the escape, a guard is killed, and Galen is found standing over him with a gun in his hand. Galen discusses the book that he found with Zayas, who then accuses him of heresy. Galen is sentenced to death for his crime. Then Verdon and Burke find out about his sentence and rescue Galen. They are all then declared enemies of the state and become fugitives. The three fugitives wander around the territory that used to be the western United States having various encounters with apes, humans, and old human civilization ruins. Cast Roddy McDowell as Galen, a young chimpanzee that is sent by Zayas with Urko to ensure the safety of two humans that have survived a crash landing on Earth. McDowell previously played Cornelius and Caesar throughout the various film versions. Ron Harper as Colonel Alan Verdon, the captain of the crash-landed ship that left Earth in 1980. James Nocton as Major Peter J. Burke, an astronaut major from ANSA that also survived the crash. Mark Leonard as Security Chief Urko 11 episodes, a violent gorilla and the series' main antagonist. Booth Coleman as Counselor Zayas 6 episodes, the highest-ranking member of the High Council of Central City in the year 3085. John Hoyt as Barlow 2 episodes, a chimpanzee prefect of Kamak who had introduced gladiatorial fights between the humans in the gladiators, and whose horse later competes against Urkars in the horse race. Jacqueline Scott two episodes, as chimpanzee farmer's daughter Zantes in The Good Seeds as Kira, and Galen's chimpanzee ex fiance and surgeon in The Surgeon. Episodes Production Discussions for a Planet of the Apes television series were made by producer Arthur P. Jacobs as early as 1971. Because of the success of the films, the idea of a television series was put on hold until after the completion of Battle for the Planet of the Apes in the first half of 1973. However, shortly after the premiere of Battle, Jacobs died, and his production company APJAC Productions sold all Planet of the Apes rights and privileges to 20th Century Fox. 
Subsequently, television rights for the first three Planet of the Apes films were sold to CBS and aired successfully in September 1973. Based largely on high viewership of Movie of the Week. TV broadcasts of the first few films, CBS began to focus away from other contenders for a new science fiction series, including Gene Roddenberry's Genesis II 1973, and look solely at the prospects for an Apes TV series. Fox and CBS went on to continue Jacob's plans of a series the following year. CBS ordered 14 episodes of Planet of the Apes to be produced. The series was filmed for the most part on location at what is now Malibu Creek State Park, with a budget of about $250,000 for each episode. Originally slated to air during CBS's Tuesday Night Family Hour, the first regular episode of the series aired on Friday, September 13, 1974 from 8 o'clock to 9 p.m. The remainder of the series aired in this same time slot until December 27, 1974, when its 14th and final broadcast was shown as a result of a premature cancellation of the series due to low ratings. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Music. The series' main theme was composed by Lalo Shirin. Shirin also scored 3 episodes of the series. Escape from Tomorrow, The Gladiators, and The Good Seeds. The latter, though not the premiere episode, was the first to be scored. Earl Hagen composed the scores for The Legacy and Tomorrow's Tide, while Richard LaSalle wrote an original score for The Trap. In addition, three episodes received partial scores. Hagen composed one for The Surgeon, LaSalle handled The Deception and music supervisor Lionel Newman composed his only music for the series with The Interrogation. Those last three, like the other episodes, were otherwise tracked with the previously written music. <laughs> <laughs> Intrada album In 2005, Intrada released an album featuring Lalo Shirin's opening and closing music along with all three of Shirin's scores and Earl Hagen's The Legacy. The album also includes the logo music for 20th Century Fox Television by Alfred Newman. Topic: <laughs> La La Land album. In 2015, La La Land Records issued a remastered and expanded limited edition album, featuring all six original scores plus the Newman material. Disc 1, music by Lalo Shirin Disc 2, theme by Lalo Shirin, music by Richard LaSalle, Earl Hagen and Lionel Newman. <laughs> Unfilmed episodes Episode 1 Written by Rod Serling as pilot episode, radically different from what aired. Episode 2. Written by Rod Serling as follow-up to his version of the pilot. Hostage. Written by Stephen Candle. A Fallen God. Written by Anthony Lawrence. The Trek. Written by Jim Burns. Freedom Road. Written by Arthur Rowe. The Mine. Written by Paul Savage. The Trial, written by Edward J. Laxo, the scripts for Episode 1, Episode 2, Hostage, and A Fallen God are available online at Hunter's Planet of the Apes Archive. Details regarding The Trek, Freedom Road, The Mine, and The Trial were provided in issue 12 of Simeon Scrolls, a Planet of the Apes based magazine, reprinted from the TV series Writer's Bible. Topic. Broadcast history The series ran in the U.S. from September 13 to December 20, 1974. The series was cancelled after half a season because of low ratings due to direct competition by NBC's Sanford and & Son and Chico and The Man. Only 13 of its 14 episodes were broadcast, all 14 episodes were later included in the DVD box set. It was later shown in reruns on the Sci-Fi Channel. 
It was screened in Britain by 13 of the 14 ITV companies from 13 October 1974 each Sunday, until 18 January 1975. STV never screened the series in 1974–75, opting to broadcast Sale of the Century instead. The series was repeated in many regions from September 1975 until 1978, but was still not seen on STV. The series then received its first UK-wide transmissions on Channel 4 in 1994, and later on the Sci-Fi Channel. The TV movie compilations have also been screened on Sky Movies, True Movies, True Entertainment who also aired the show in original form and Horror Channel. In 2019 METV began airing the series as part of its late Saturday night, Red Eye Sci-Fi, block. Topic telefilms In 1980, several episodes of the series were edited into five made-for-television movies. Back to the Planet of the Apes Escape from Tomorrow and The Trap Forgotten City of the Planet of the Apes Gladiators and Legacy Treachery and Greed on the Planet of the Apes Horse Race and The Tyrant Life, Liberty and Pursuit on the Planet of the Apes The Surgeon and The Interrogation Farewell to the Planet of the Apes Tomorrow's Tide and Up Above the World So High When the Planet of the Apes telefilms entered syndication, ABC's owned and operated stations, who picked them up for their afternoon movie programs under titles such as the 430 movie, called called upon Roddy McDowell to recreate his role of Galen in a series of new openings and closings specifically for these stations, billed as The New Planet of the Apes. The introductions originally created by 20th Century Fox to open each film were replaced by a now-aged Galen McDowell looking back on the events of the telefilms. The openings and closings revealed Verdon and Burke's final fates, they found their computer in another city and disappeared into space as suddenly as they'd arrived, according to TV Zone Special No. 17 1995 issue McDowell filmed these two years after the demise of the first-run episodes of the Planet of the Apes television series, which would be December, 1976. The ABC openings and closings of these telefilms were neither aired on other stations nor included on any home media release. Topic. Spin offs Most of the books and comics based on Planet of the Apes are based on the films, not the TV series. However, there are some titles that do involve the TV show characters. Novelizations four novelizations of episodes, written by George Alec Effinger, were published by Award Books. Their titles are Planet of the Apes No. 1, Man the Fugitive. Planet of the Apes No. 2, Escape from Tomorrow Planet of the Apes No. 3, Journey into Terror Planet of the Apes No. 4, Lord of the Apes British Annuals Brown Watson Books published three hardcover annuals featuring original stories about Verdon, Burke and Galen. These stories are a combination of comic strips and short fiction. Audio Adventures — Power Records produced four audio-only adventures based on the TV show. Their titles were Mountain of the Delphi Battle of Two Worlds Dawn of the Tree People Volcano Argentine Comics — Seven Spanish-language comics were published in Argentina, written by Jorge Claudio Morhain and Richard Barrero and illustrated by Sergio Mulco and T. Toledo. Released only in Argentina, they have never been officially published in English. However, PDFs of the comics, translated to English by fans, are available at Cassidy Ray's site see link below. Filmstrip Story — Chad Valley, a UK toy company, produced 32 short film-based comic strips containing an original TV series-era story, packaged as the Chad Valley picture show Planet of the Apes Sliderama Projector very similar to the many give a show projector sets of the 1970s. These strips are extremely rare and difficult to come by. Topic. Notes and references Topic. External links Planet of the Apes on IMDb Planet of the Apes at TV. Com Cassidy's POTA television series site, Galen's final TV appearance, Argentine comics, screencaps, collectibles, articles, photos, books, stories and more. Stories from Chalo a POTA TV website. 
Mesa's UK site, an older POTA TV site. Hunter's Planet of the Apes Archive, extensive fan site with information on all original films and series, with full television scripts, comics and other relevant material. Planet of the Apes Media Archive, multimedia website. Planet of the Apes, The Forbidden Zone, one of the oldest and most complete Planet of the Apes sites. Back to the Planet of the Apes on IMDb. Forgotten City of the Planet of the Apes on IMDb. Treachery and Greed on the Planet of the Apes on IMDb Life, Liberty and Pursuit on the Planet of the Apes on IMDb Farewell to the Planet of the Apes on IMDb